Hello, I'm Mike Chambers, and I filed bankruptcy myself. One of the things that's going to happen when you file bankruptcy is you're going to have secured debts and non-secured debt. Secured debts is something that is secured by property, a house, a car, computer, uh, washing machine you're making payments on. Those are secured debt. And in order to keep those things, you have to keep making the payments on them. Um, you may be able to uh, put it off for a little while. They have to stop, you know, harassing you and all that other stuff. Once you file your bankruptcy, technically, they're supposed to stop calling you stop harassing you and not come attempt to pick up or repossess the item. However, this is also a really good opportunity to make sure that you make your credit look good and make sure you have a place when you're done with your bankruptcy that you're able to go back to and still have good credit and also a chance to get a good deal in some cases. Now, on the case of my computer, I was pretty close to paying it off. I've been paying on it for about a year, year and a half, and I was pretty close to paying it off, but when I filed my bankruptcy, I didn't know for sure what I was supposed to do. And looking at my contract, I had a pretty substantial penalty on that, um, a dollar a day for a late fee. And so the dollar a day for a late fee doesn't go towards the principal amount. And if I would wait until the end of the whole uh, four months or whatever it takes to go through my chapter seven bankruptcy, they would have the right to come back and repossess it, or I would have the right to pay it off in full, most likely all of the bills and everything added on to it with the interest and the bad penalties, it wouldn't make it worthwhile. So I was able to talk to my computer people and instead of paying off close to $850 with my penalties and what it would end up being, I was able to make a deal to pay it off for $150. Now, I notified the bankruptcy court when I went in to talk to the trustee under oath. I told them that on that secured debt, instead of reaffirming that debt, we were going to conclude that debt and I was going to pay it off for $150. And although it hasn't happened that my bankruptcy is completed, I don't believe that they're going to take my computer and try to sell it as a used item online by the court and try to split that money up to all of my uh, debtors. So I believe that I will be able to keep that as one of my personal items that will then be exempt from, from the bankruptcy. I'll know for sure, but I do know this. Um, if I do not keep paying my payments on it, they have the right to repossess it. And if I do reaffirm the debt and I've been late, I've got a dollar a day penalties. So none of that sounds like the right things to do. So have a good day.